All right, so we have Palace and AMG 2.0, um, as the as the video says right there. Uh, it's going to be releasing this Friday, March 25th at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. You can calculate what that will be for you. And it's kind of an interesting collaboration. I saw a lot of people saying it was like not the greatest, a little bit mid. Um, and I myself was not the biggest fan of the AMG original, the 1.0 collaboration. And I, I don't know. I feel like this has some some decent pieces, but I think it's kind of weird. And we'll get into that right now after, after we get through these promotional images of uh, different benzes with graphics done up on them for Palace, which, I don't know, just promotional pieces, I guess. I don't think they sold any benzes last time. Um, but anyway, it's not like Kith when they sold the BMWs, but uh, this is why I thought it was weird. It's almost more of a workwear collaboration or like a workwear inspired collaboration, I, sh I should say, because a lot of the silhouettes are workwear. You see right here, we have this kind of canvas jacket. I believe it's corduroy collar. And then you get the little square patch, obviously very reminiscent of something like Carhartt. So your mind just, you know, almost immediately goes there given the style of jacket, the branding. So I, I thought it was interesting that um, a collaboration with AMG, they kind of take it to the workwear um, sphere which I guess, you know, cars, workwear, but I don't know, AMG is kind of like high class. Mercedes-Benz, you know, you don't think of like dudes in Carhartt or anything like that. <laughs> Maybe a very clean dealership with um, the the overalls, the like one, one piece full suits, but I don't know, this is what they're going for. They have the vest, same colorway, you get that nice tan, which I, I do like the tan, I don't know about the orange patch, but I don't know. Uh, continuing that theme, also we're getting double knee pants, which are a very workwear silhouette. We get it in black as well. And then we have the black vest that we just saw. <clears throat> we get, I'm not, sure, I'm not sure what the material is on this, um, I could be wrong, but it does look like a thicker zip up. Maybe it's a canvas material. Maybe it's like a Gore-Tex material. I know they've done uh, like full zip Gore-Tex hoodies before. So, um, but yeah, we get the Palace AMG branding there. And then, uh, yeah, so <laughs> I don't know. Like I said, I don't know the material, but this definitely looks like it might be canvas. Um, definitely looks like it might maybe be <laughs> contradicting myself. Um, but yeah, I, I don't know. It's all right. I guess the orange looks kind of cool on this. It works with the the tan they're going for. We have a white long sleeve. You get the AMG patch there, Palace AMG with the little triferg. We get this tan once again, this mustard almost. Now we get a black one, get an orange one, <laughs> and then we're getting into some graphic tees. Um, or I'm not sure if this would be a graphic tee, more of like a um, all over print tee, which this is, this type of design is definitely more in line with the AMG 1.0 collaboration that they did. We saw a lot of stuff like this. Saw it on hoodies, <clears throat> tees, like some jackets. So that makes more sense. But um, the workwear stuff is a little uh, surprising to see from them. That, that being said, I really don't like that shirt. I, I don't like what they have going on here. It's almost like a tiger pattern. Then you have this tonal one, not digging it. Uh, we, we have this galaxy one, which kind of reminds me of some like Zoomies cat designs you would have seen like mid 2000s. We have another gradient one, Los Angeles. We got some hats going on, which not really feeling the hats. And we got some beanies, which, you know, once again, kind of going with uh, toward the workwear vibes. I get the Carhartt beanie with the patch in the center. Um, vibes from these got like a hunting a hunting looking one and then that's it for the collaboration so very workwear inspired which I, I was surprised to see from this collaboration i'm not sure how many people who are like super into mercedes amg are going to be into things like carhartt and stuff i feel like it might be a little too high class but maybe i'm wrong then again looking at the upvote to downvote ratio on uh, max merch's instagram uh, people seem to not be really liking it, but 
that's all I got. Let me know what you guys think about this collaboration. Are you excited for it? Do you like it? Would you have liked to see something different? As always, thank you for watching and I will catch you in the next video.